Anderson and the KXY4 Extreme Team back at it again. This week, helping the Spokane Boxing Club and a knockout in their new downtown Spokane home. A lot of work to be done in this historic building at First and Jefferson. And if anyone is ready for it, uh, you know it's Mark and his crew. And by the end of the week, that building will be a new home to the Spokane boxers of all levels and backgrounds. KXY 4's Caroline Rourke working for you. She joins us from their new home downtown. And Caroline, uh, you have a touching story of one young boxer's need to succeed. Nadine, this young man really is exceptional. He's barely a teenager, but he's already setting an example for his teammates here at Spokane Boxing. Like most athletes, Teddy Palm likes to win. I want to be able to dodge any punch that comes at me and just let it just run off of me and smile. It shows. He's only lost twice. Teddy is uh, hes exceptional. hes He's got a big career in boxing, and uh, he's just, beyond all that, first of all, he's just a good kid. I mean, he owes part of that determination to his mother. She told me that if I didn't get my grades up, then I wouldn't be boxing, and that just shut me down immediately because this is my favorite sport. This is, like, my life right now. Love up. Coach Rick Welliver was once a boxer himself. He teaches his students more than just how to handle themselves in the ring. Rick taught me that we're a family and you have to show everybody respect. You're ready to move your head now. One, two, hook two. Now that family is building a new home, a new gym downtown that will allow Spokane Boxing to expand. Welliver hopes the new location will give at-risk kids a place to be a part of something. Boxing's a sport where everyone's included and inclusion matters something Teddy takes to heart. Every time a kid walks in, it just makes me focus more because I want them to look, look up to me like someone they'd want to be just like. For now, he's focusing on the sport he loves. It makes me happy. It gives me satisfaction knowing that I'm getting better no matter what I do. Teddy says he wants to become a professional boxer first, but he hasn't ruled out basketball or football just yet. For now, you'll probably find him here at Spokane Boxing's newest home. Reporting from downtown Spokane, Caroline Rourke, KXY4 News.